6.15. If you catch one thing all day here on KSAT, it has to be this. A KSAT Kids <laughs> update. A few weeks back, our photographer Bill Calder and his son William found a bird nest with five eggs in their backyard while staying at home. Well, they set up a live camera that has been on KSAT.com, and now the little birds have left the nest just two weeks after hatching. William files his final bird nest report. As you can see, I'm in the backyard and I'm by the baby bird's nest. Um, the hatchlings have left and that gave me the opportunity to be here. We saw the mother bird remove the eggshells as newborns hatch. At first they were kind of ugly. They had big bulging eyeballs and bright yellow beaks. They slept and slept. <coughs> Mom and Dad worked all day to bring them something to eat. They searched the grass flower pots and all around to bring nutritious bugs back to the brood. When mom and dad brought food back, the baby birds peeped and opened their mouths really wide. We saw the parents reaching all the way in the nest while holding onto the pot with their feet. The baby Carolina wrens grew pretty fast. Soon mother bird couldn't fit in the nest anymore. At first their feathers looked kind of like hair. After about a week, they began to get their feathers and grew into their eyeballs. Their nest quickly becoming too small for the fast growing birdies, ready to stretch their wings. <whistles> On Mother's Day, the first fledgling eating left the nest. And the next morning, Meanie, Money, and Mo left. You can see the last bird Mo hops out and climbs up on the nest. Mo takes a look around then flies off to the patio, where he hid by our window before taking off. Amy made it over to this rock in the yard. Their brown feathers blend in with the leaves on the ground like camouflage. Sadly, it never hatched. About a week ago, we saw a barred owl hunting larger birds in the neighborhood. As our birdies leave the nest, we hope they make it through the food chain unharmed and return to build a nest in our backyard next year. Reporting in my backyard for KSAT Kids, William Caldera, KSAT 12 News.